What's up? This is Squad 2440. We're following some major 17 videos. Today we'll be doing some ice road trucking here on the Arctic map. We'll be using the Oshkosh semi truck with the low boy, and we'll be transporting this log cabin over to its destination for the winter season. We'll be staying at it and doing some hunting trips, which should be a lot of fun. We'll be hopping in the Oshkosh semi truck, which is one very powerful and strong semi truck made for some good off roading. And since it is winter, I I thought that this would be the perfect fit for us. So we'll turn our beacon lights and LED lights on, and we will be going over some ice, which is pretty much frozen since we are here in the Arctic. And overall, I'm very excited for it. So we are going to be heading out onto the trail right here in front of us. Now there's a few sections of ice, so we do have to be pretty careful because if we go too fast, we could easily slide down these snowy trails. I would like to thank each and every one of you for the continued support on the daily content. And I hope you guys are having a great day today. Let me know how it is down below in the comments. But as you guys can see, we are now going to kind of go slowly down this. You can see the ice way down there in the distance. And we do not want to run into any problems. So we'll kind of just slowly crawl down this hill. As you guys can see, it's a very, very steep hill. And if we get too much momentum, we could crash, spin out at the bottom. But I mean, this is one very cool truck. It is color changeable. And I mean, this was made to haul some very heavy, heavy tons of equipment, which is pretty cool, and I think we'll be using this in a few videos on the Xbox One, but as you guys can see, we are pretty much crawling down here, trying to be as safe as we can, and if you would like to see more ice road trucking videos here on the channel, let me know down below in the comments. We could do many different types, and I'm very excited for the winter season with all of the seasonal videos coming, but as you guys can see, we pretty much made it down the hill safely, which is good. Now, we do have ramps in the back but we just kind of place a log cabin here with a crane and overall it should be pretty well. We did actually haul a similar log cabin earlier on in the fall season and we prepared that for another map which was pretty cool but this one we have to go over ice and take a look at this so I actually want to get out make sure that this ice looks safe. Looks like they do have some markers which is pretty helpful but it looks like there's some grass kind of coming through which isn't the best. Overall, the ice does not have any cracks, which is perfect. That means that we are pretty much safe to go, and we'll definitely crawl on it very slowly, kind of uh, do it because we do not want all that weight going on the ice too fast, since uh, this could easily break. And ice road trucking is pretty dangerous, and you always want to make sure, even when you walk on ice over a pond, that the ice is strong enough to hold you. But as you guys can see, we are now on the ice. We'll have to drive pretty slow and stay at a constant rate. We do not want to slow ourselves down, since the water underneath most likely is moving around just a little bit but as you guys can see we are continuing down and I really do like this semi truck I think we'll be featuring this in a lot more videos they do actually have a pretty cool camo for it also but this Oshkosh is one very cool truck and like we're saying it's amazing so as you guys can see we are pretty much crawling over it and this low boy is a very special low boy it does come with this Oshkosh which is pretty cool and all of the wheels of it do turn which is also another pretty cool feature so it looks like we are coming over here onto land very soon which is pretty exciting I really do not like to drive on ice especially with a very heavy cabin and this truck also weighs a lot so we kind of made it over here but it looks like we'll have to go on another section if you do have any cool ideas for any ice road trucking videos, let me know down below in the comments. I would like to do kind of one winter hauling video a week, and I think ice road trucking would be a pretty cool thing to do. So I think we'll kind of continue down and go over here. Looks like there's a little bit more ice. Wow, there is a lot more coming up. So we definitely have to double check, make sure that it is safe, because we do not want to... Uh, lose this log cabin but like we're saying guys we will be doing some camping trips kind of going out to the cabin we might do a few hunting videos and everything like that so as you guys can see i mean we are pretty much going all the way around and i mean this is going to be a bit of a challenge especially going up the steep hill in front of us I hope you guys are excited for all of the very cool videos coming to the channel and since the holiday season is coming up and we'll probably be going on break I will be doing a few extra live streams throughout the holiday break which should be very exciting but as you guys can see we do actually have to climb up a very steep hill coming up and I think that that's going to be a pretty big challenge for us. One of the biggest challenges when going over snow and ice is traction. It looks like these uh, wheels on the semi truck are pretty good and the tires are also pretty new on it which is pretty helpful. But hopefully we'll be able to climb up without any problems. 
As you guys can see, we are going just around at most 30 miles per hour, just trying to take it slow, make it safe, because we definitely do not want to lose our load or even kind of get ourselves stuck, slide around since it is pretty slippery with all of the ice and these very, very cold temperatures. But as you guys can see, you could see a little bit of the camera, which is pretty cool. But I thought that the blacked out uh, Oshkosh truck looks awesome. That's why I kind of chose this. But we are going up a very steep hill. It looks like we are slowing down. But wow, I mean, this truck still climbing up. Take a look at that, guys. We are still making up it, which is pretty exciting. And I mean, this is one pretty long ice road trucking haul, which is pretty cool. And I really do like that name since it kind of goes along with winter. And there is actually a pretty cool series, as you guys can see. But take a look at that, guys. These wheels are pretty helpful. There are so many wheels, which does help distribute all of the weight to make it a bit easier for us. But as you guys can see, we pretty much made it over here to the top. And it looks like, no, we still have a lot to go, which is pretty helpful. So we're going to continue up it. We are going pretty slow though. And I think that it will be pretty cool to kind of add this to a few series. So let me know what types of videos should we do with this truck because it's a very cool truck and I would like to feature it in a few more. But it looks like we are kind of coming up to the end of the trail pretty soon, which is actually pretty exciting for us, which means that we made it all the way safely. But like I was saying, I do appreciate all of the support on the daily content. You guys are awesome with all of that. But it looks like we are just about to arrive. Yeah, take a look at that, guys. We have arrived. And I actually want to kind of go off course just a little bit to find us a pretty good area so we'll definitely have to kind of stop take a look at where we want it to go because we want it to go in the woods a little bit so I think we'll kind of stop just about here kind of get out we do want to keep the truck running let's see can we probably squeeze in between here all the way down here I mean this area over here yeah this would be the perfect area come down in here and put it right here so this looks to be good we'll definitely give it a try to see if we could come down here and I mean it's a pretty large truck and trailer but we'll definitely give it a try Awesome, so now we are back in this truck, and it looks like the trailer should be able to kind of squeeze by, and this is definitely going to be a bit of a challenge, and especially since, I mean, very heavy load, we do not want to damage it, but yes, we will be squeezing by, it looks like we are losing some traction in some areas, but next up, we'll kind of go into the first person view, and I think we'll just kind of continue to drive straight, wow, take a look at that, guys, we are pretty much almost like going to tip over it looks like we are not even going to lose traction and this is going to be a pretty dangerous turn and take a look at that looks like we are pulling a wheelie in the front wow slotting around in the front I mean not the best decision to kind of go through this area but we are making it work and that's going to be a tight one Awesome, so as you guys can see, we got to this section over here, and let's see, we actually want to kind of continue just a little bit more, and then go right over here, so I mean, we are getting pretty close, I just wanted to get out, make sure that we were in the correct area, but we'll kind of, uh, have to watch out, wow, just about on three wheels there, in the front section, so we have to turn and come down here, now this is a little bit unrealistic, but this is the only way that we could really get this log cabin to its position. So as you guys can see, I mean, we are taking this directly through the woods, and we do have to watch out for this tree, but wow, take a look at that, guys. We pretty much got this to some level ground here in the woods, which is pretty exciting, and I hope you guys enjoyed today's ice road trucking video here in Farming Simulator 17 on the Pacific map. Thanks for watching, have a great day, and subscribe for more.